pods are prefabricated bathrooms. They're in hotels, they're in hospitals, they're in apartments. There are a number of benefits by incorporating pods into a commercial project. From the lean construction, building a pod in a controlled environment so that you can actually introduce a complete product on the job site that is basically a plug and play. This will significantly enhance the schedule. It reduces the manpower required on site. It eliminates the coordination of the delivery of materials the waste management, and the coordination between the multiple trades that occupy this space, which happens to require more people per square foot than virtually any area within a building. Usually when anybody's talking about BIM, they're, they're usually talking about a 3D model, and within that 3D model you have these different elements that um, create whatever scope of work it is that you're into. So for us it would be walls and ceilings and doors and studs and ceiling framing. So what you really have is a prototype in the digital world before you actually go out into the real world and start building. Everybody's scope comes into the picture. So I got a plumber, I got electrical, I got steel, and it comes up in a 3D model and you can find where there might be a problem. Like a penetration is in the middle of a stud or a pipe is in the middle of a, a beam. Before you start building it, you can solve those problems. Modular specifically is really a trend that's a big deal and Pods is the leader of modular stuff right now. We can help you think about things that maybe you didn't think of. Because of the relationships that we've developed as we've been building Pods, we can help with specifying of materials. So your economies of scale go up, your labor goes down, and we've helped you budget your Pod everybody realizes how important that is to make a project go smoothly. On the job site, our flow, our construction flow, our manpower flow is really dependent on, on our partners, the electrical, the mechanical, and the other subs on the job. So if the other subs aren't ready in an area, then we have disruptions and we have to move forces around, and we really don't have that flow to actually do things very efficiently. Uh, when we are in a controlled environment, we set up that project flow. The mechanics are lined out and they're able to build things in a timely fashion and they're able to go from one step to the next step to the next step to the next step without interruption. And we're able to actually speed projects up two to three months, you know, from the timeline that it takes to do a job. As we're building the pods, we are inspecting them every day. And through the process, we have several inspection points that happen. So at that point, it's right when it leaves. One of the biggest things that we see on construction sites is the lack of laydown areas for, from every trade, from structural steel to drywall to dumpsters. With this system, all that's eliminated. All that shows up is one truck, products brought to your job site, and it's delivered. Imagine one shipment versus 15 or 20 with the original stocking and supplying of all of the other product that would need to be coming to your job site. This situation eliminates all of that stocking and cleaning all the way down to one delivery, one install. I mean, the things we're doing eventually will become an everyday item, I think. But by being the first one, we really do start the process and get to be the leader.